Making a payment in Web Access. First, navigate to your Web Access site for your association as provided by your management company. Choose Sign In at the top right. Fill in your email address, your password, and then choose Sign In at the bottom. When you first get into your association website, you should be brought to the dashboard. From the dashboard, you'll see your current balance and you can simply choose Make a Payment. Or from any other page, you can simply choose Pay Assessments up on the top menu bar. Once on the payments page, you can use the top of the page to make a one-time payment or the bottom of the page to set up recurring payments. To set up a one-time payment, you'll see that your information should automatically be filled out on the screen. Then choose whether you're going to make an e-check or a credit card payment. You should see how much you owe today and the amount you're going to be paying. For an e-check, fill in all the bank account information and then choose Submit e-check payment. For a credit card, fill in the amount, fill in all the credit card information, and then choose Submit. For a recurring payment, go to the bottom of the screen and choose New Recurring Payment. Again, you'll see your information should automatically be filled in on the screen, and at the bottom, you can choose to make a recurring e-check or credit card payment. For e-check, Choose the amount you want to pay, all the bank information, the frequency of your payment, and the date of your payment. And then choose Submit e-check payment. For a credit card payment, again, put in the amount of the payment, the frequency, and the date, fill in all the credit card information, and then choose Submit. Be aware, all fields with an asterisk are required. Once you submit your payment, it should bring you to the finalized screen where you'll see any fees associated with this transaction. And then once you're done, it'll bring you to the confirmation page where you can then print a receipt of your payment. You should receive an email that your payment has been accepted or declined. For recurring payments, you'll also receive emails if your payment was declined, if your payment is going to expire, if you have an upcoming payment, once your payment is paid, and if you ever stop your recurring payment. Thank you.